Hello, and welcome to Atheist Bible Study. I'm Joe Dixon. In comic book form. Do you like this? I'm not drawn. <laughs> anyway, um, for those who don't know, I read from the Children's Bible. Children's Bible! Children's Bible! Bible for children! I read from the Children's Bible, and um, I interpret it, I guess. To be able to fit myself through this, I have to have an adult beverage. And generally, the last couple of uh, weeks... Or months even, it's been uh, gin and tonic. So that's what's in this little bottle here, gin and tonic. If you got them, drink them, because I'm going to gobble this thing down. Mm. Ah, gin and tonic. Why gin and tonic? Well, supposedly, of all the drinks, gin is supposed to be um, the least fattening. And people go, well, you know, tonic has a lot of calories in it. But if you get non-fat tonic, it's uh, or non-calorie or whatever the fuck it is. Anyway. That's what I'm drinking. Ah. All right. Let's move on. Now, last time we saw the story, Paul, who is now the star of our show, has been in trouble with the Popo. And now he's being sent off to Rome. And the story is called Paul's Journey to Rome. If you want to find it in the adult Bible, uh, you should probably go to Acts 27. That's what it says in the children's Bible here that I'm reading from. It says it's from Acts 27, but its story is called Paul's Journey to Rome. Rome! Have you ever been to Rome? That's where he, uh, uh, well, I guess it isn't actually his home, but he's definitely going. Baby, he's going. He's going to Rome. Ba -ba -da -ba 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 -da. He's going. He's going to Rome. Ba -da -ba -da -ba -da -da -da. Rome, Rome, Rome. That's where he's got to go. He's got to go to Rome. He's got to go to Rome. That's not his home, baby, but it's where he's going. He's got a journey. <laughs> to Rome. All right, let's read this. Paul's journey to Rome. All right. When it was decided, when it was decided that Paul should sail to Italy, Italy. Have you ever been to Italy? Italy. You know, that's where they didn't invent spaghetti. That was in Asia. Did you know that? Not in Italy. But they make fine spaghetti. But it just wasn't invented by them. It was actually, actually, Asians did that first. Chinese. Can you say Chinese? Stop. Go back to the Bible. When it was decided that Paul should sail to Italy, they delivered him and certain other prisoners to one named Julius and centurion of Augustus' forces. And they get this motherfucker out here. Julius, you take him. Like, all right, all right. He was of Augustus' forces. Augustus' forces! I don't know if that's good or bad. I presume it's not good. Well, if you're a prisoner, regardless of who they're giving you to, it's probably a bad thing. Anyway, move on, Joe. Boarding a ship of... Now, this is going to be fun because I have no idea how to pronounce this. Boarding the ship of Adramitima, that's uh, spelled A, a D, R, A, M, Y, T, T, I, U, M. You got to make that smacking sound when you say it, too. When you spell it out. Adramitima. Anyway, they launched forth, meaning to sail along the coast of Asia. See? See, I told you. That's where they got the spaghetti. The next day, they touched at Sidon, and Julius courteously gave Paul liberty to go to his friends to refresh himself. Because this is what you do when you have a prisoner. You go, hey, motherfucker, you stink. Go refresh yourself. I'm going to go let you hang out with your friends for a while. That's my prisoner. I'm just going to let you go refresh yourself there and uh, come back. Come back in like an hour. How long does it get you to refresh yourself? Uh, just go quick, take a quick, quick bath. You know, brush your teeth and uh, see you back here. Maybe like a, I'll give you 90 minutes. How's that? An hour and a half. That should be more than enough time, right? Anyway, um, when they left there, they sailed along the coast of Cyprus because the winds were contrary. And when the winds are contrary, you got to sail along Cyprus. Um, uh, uh, they came to Myria, a city of Lycia. Hey, I didn't invent these names. It's in the goddamn Bible, all right? Not my fault. Not my fault. All right. Um, where was I? Where the centurions found a ship from Alexandria sailing to Italy. 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 Oh. 
And he put his prisoners on it. That's when you get in Italy, you put your prisoners on No, he put it on the ship. He's on a ship. Uh, sailed to Italy. He put his prisoners on it. That's uh, Julius. You remember him? When they had sailed slowly many days without favorable winds, they got to have winds. They got to they gotta have some mighty wind. They came to a place which is called the Fair Havens. That's owned by Richie's parents. Near the city of Lacia. Much time had passed, and seafaring was now dangerous. Woo, dangerous. For the winter had nearly come. I, I, I know about winter. We got it here in New York City. It's freezing. You're freezing your balls off. Balls off. Balls off. I'm pretending I edited that, but it's really just me going up and down a room. Um, Paul warned them. So, I'm sorry. This is Paul's voice. Let me do <clears throat> Paul warned them. So, I foresee that this voyage will bring damage and loss, not only of the cargo ship, but also of our lives. Mm-hmm. Tempest at Sea is the next uh, chapter in a scintillating, scintillating story. Anyway, uh, nevertheless, the centurion believed that the captain, I'm sorry, the Saturian believed the captain and the owner of the ship were more than Paul. So he believed them more than Paul. Why would he do that? Why would he believe more than Paul? And Paul's only a prisoner. <laughs> Why would he not listen to him? What is the matter with this man? And because, and because the harbor was not well suited to winter, and most people, try that again, Joe. And because the harbor was not well suited to winter, in most people divide, uh, uh-huh. and because the w- harbor was not well suited to winter, because the harbor was not well suited to winter in. I got you now. All right. Most people advised departure in order, if it were at all possible, to reach Phoenix. I don't know how they got to, how they're going to get to Arizona from here, but that's where they got to get to Phoenix. I, I don't know where that came from, which is the harbor of Crete. I didn't know Phoenix had a harbor of Crete. I didn't know Arizona. Does John McCain know? And winter there. And they're going to winter there in Crete, which is near Phoenix, which is, um, I think, where Alice lives. When the south... Wind blew softly, thinking that they would reach their goal. They untied and set sail close to Crete. Crete, 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 Crete. Like Italy, but it's Crete. But very soon there arose a mighty gale. See? Mighty wind, mighty gale. I think that's where they got the name of that movie from. It was called, they called it a mighty gale, but they didn't want it to have any. They didn't want people to think it was a biblical thing, so they called it a mighty wind. Uh, the ship was caught and could not face, it, face into the wind, so they let it run before it. Did you follow that? They couldn't let it run. So let, uh, the ship couldn't run. So they, the ship was caught and could not face into the wind. So they let it run before. They let, before, re, let it run before the <laughs> wind. And ran behind a small island called Claudia. So they behind a small island named Claudia. Hey, Claudia. Hi. Hey, Claudia, you big old island. You, oh, you're so fresh. They have much. Do people say, still say fresh these days? I don't think they do. Except for bread or something. Or their food is fresh. But I don't think. I don't think women call a man fresh. I think like. Asshole is what they'll call them today. Because the women are such classy today. No. Completely understandable. Um, they had much work in making fast the ship's boat. When the boat had been taken up, they ran ropes under the ship to secure it. This is fascinating stuff, people. Then fearing that they might run into the sand, they struck the sail and let the ship adrift. Um, you know, uh, ugh, God. Um, Moby Dick. Couldn't, it was, uh, couldn't have been more exciting than this. Being greatly tossed about by the tempest, the next day they lightened the ship. And the following day, I don't know how they lightened the ship because they threw something overboard, didn't say. The following day with their own hands, they threw off the ship's tackle. Hey, tackle, get out. Get out. Oh, don't throw me out. I'm just a tackle. Get out. But when neither sun nor stars appeared for many days and the great storm still raged, all hope of being saved was given up. It's, uh-oh, we are fucked. Oh, my. We are so fucked. But, oh, but after going without food for a long time, doesn't say how long, just says a long time, probably 40 days, since that's the 40 is a very popular number in the Bible. But after going without food for a long time, Paul stood up in the midst of them and said, Sir, I'm sorry, Sir, 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 you should have listened to me and not have loosened. Is not, not have loosened from Crete. Should not have loosened from, loosened from Crete. Uh, it's just like Crete. Nah, 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 nah. But now I exhort you to be of good cheer. Be of good cheer. Nah, 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 nah. Uh, for there shall be no loss of any man's life among you. Nah, 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 nah. Because only the ship, but only the ship, 
For there stood by me this night the angel of God. God came to me, not you. He came to me. Say, say. God came to me, say. He talked to me, say. I don't want any stuff out of you, say. I'm the boss man around here, say. God came to me, say. For they stood by me that for th there stood by me that night the angel of God. <laughs> For whose I am and whom I serve. Who I am and who I serve. For who, whose I am and whom I serve. I am. Uh, will I am is in this book. Saying, fear not, Paul. You must be brought before Caesar. And lo, God has put under your protection all them that sail with you. Therefore, uh, therefore, says, therefore, says, be of good cheer. For I believe God that it shall be even as it was told me. However, we must be cast upon a certain island. I don't know. They're saying the storm is fucked up, but God has told them it's going to be okay. That's that's a long and short of what I just goddamn read. All right. I think that's it. We're not going to do the next chapter, are we? Nah. The next chapter is going to be the ship runs aground. They get rushed up on an island, uh, probably Gilligan's Island style. We'll find out. And uh, we'll pick up from there. So the next story is going to be the ship runs aground. And we'll go on the adventures of Paul on the island. Uh, probably um, the boys will have a very good time. Then after that, we're going to do Paul's final years. Oh, can't wait. Can't wait. And then there's a whole bunch of sub-chapters there. Then we're going to do Letters of Peter. That's going to eventually come up. A lot, of, a lot of Peter letters. And then they're going to do the vision of John. John's vision. And then that's the end. That's the end. We'll be at the end of the goddamn Bible. Children's Bible. Children's Bible. Bible for children. We'll be done. We'll be done. And I can finally stop doing this. I don't know why I put myself through this. Why? Why do I keep reading this horrible book? Why do I hate myself so much? I don't know. I don't know why I do it. I don't know. Praise Jesus. All right. All right. Anyway, that is Paul's journey to Rome. Tempest at sea. Then we'll do, uh, like I said, the next one's going to be uh, the ship runs aground. Bang bang! All right. And then we'll just go on to the rest of these excellent chapters of the world's greatest book. It's the holy book. Holy book. It's holy. You treat it with the, with the respect it deserves. I know I do. All right. Thank you very much for watching this. Why you watch it, I have no idea. But thank you so much, and uh, see you next time.